Planet Comic Con Kansas City's 25th anniversary. Are you kidding me? What's up, everybody? It's me, Greg Miller from Kind of Funny. And guess what I'm holding? That's right. The Kryptonian key from Smallville. What's my favorite Planet Comic Con Kansas City memory? None other than 2019, of course, when I got to host the Superman panel to end all Superman panels. Me. Smallville's Michael Rosenbaum, Smallville's Tom Welling, and of course, Lois and Clark's Dean Kane talking about what it means to be the Man of Steel and Lex Luthor and insulting Michael Rosenbaum. It was a great time. Uh, obviously, as a Superman fan, it was one of the crowning achievements of my career. So I'm happy for you to see some stuff from it. But of course, congratulations, Planet Comic Con. I hope you invite us back soon. We, I'd love to come back to Kansas City. I'm a Mizzou grad. Come on, M-I-Z. Uh, what could convince me to go back and watch it? My delicious right. breath. Actually, how about this? Here, here's I, I, one reason. Turn around and look at all of these people. Yeah. Yeah. And and the sec and the second question is, and I mean this sincerely, what made you come to this panel if you haven't seen either? Greg. Oh, Greg. Yeah. I'm just curious, like Greg and he commit and okay. also you came to see him. Oh. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on, Dean, really? Tom, the let point. me ask him a question. Hold on, this is interrogate. This is why I should be an FBI agent. Watch this, watch this, Greg. Do you watch any shows, uh, DC shows? Uh, now I do. What do you watch, man? Uh, I used to watch Flash. Do you watch Arrow? Not anymore. Okay, Supergirl? No. But you watch Arrow, right? Uh, yeah. And guess why Arrow's on the air? Because Smallville was on the air before that. Good, yeah, no. Yeah, that's the reason, yeah. bro. That's your reason, bro. Now you and Greg can just sit down. No, I'm kidding. But thank, thank, you. You. thank you. Thank you. Right. No problem. You're brave. You're a brave man. I'm short. Um, what was your guys' favorite part about shooting the show? Where are your shoes? Uh, over there. My feet hurt. I've been okay. walking all day. Just want to make sure you so know. I where. smell. <laughs> What was the question? I'm sorry. What was your favorite part about shooting any of the shows that you guys were on? Favorite any part about shows. shooting the shows, yeah. Well, I enjoyed when I was on SVU. That Oh, wait, we're not talking about <laughs> any of the shows. Not any of the shows? Okay. Uh, well, one of the things that's really fun about doing a show, uh, you're spending so much time on set, you do sort of become, and it's sort of cliche to say it, like a family. But clearly, it happens. These two. Um, you become a family, and you know each other so well because you spend like every waking moment together for nine and a half, ten months a year, and you go through, and life happens on the outside, so you really have to go through these things with everybody. Um, life happens, <laughs> yes. Uh, so you become like a family. So there's something about that that's pretty cool. And, it is and true. I enjoyed that. What's going on up there? I can just see myself here. It's kind of cool. <laughs> Oh, oh, you're looking but for a visual. But there's no egos at the table. No one's video. Not at the table. <laughs> not at the table. Not at the table. It's just kind of neat. I'm sorry. But yeah, it is a family. It is. It really is a family. And I love that sort of dynamic, dynamic about it. I spent as much time in college as I spent doing the show. Wow. You did too, right? Ten years of college? <laughs> college. <laughs> no, college. <laughs> that is how I look at it, to be honest, because I didn't That's, go to college. It's I, a huge I got, I got a graduate time. degree in Smallville. It's unbelievable. Yeah. Think about how much time that is. Ten years. By the way, yeah. ten seasons, you guys. God bless you. Oh, but... Only uh, seven. Seventy percent. Seven. But I. <laughs> it's funny because I've never asked you this, and maybe I should ask this in private. But since you're all here, <laughs> one of the funny things that I always enjoyed was trying to figure out on Smallville how to do the visual and physical effects, because like at one point they they had like a Ford F-150 with the treadmill on the back. <laughs> And they drove the truck at like 20 miles an hour, and then they had the treadmill going. And then I was running on the treadmill <laughs> while the truck was moving, while another truck had a camera and filming me. And I'm like, I don't think this is safe. And everybody's like, no, this isn't safe. <laughs> don't fall. Like, if you fall, we're all fucked. <laughs> and for you, there's, ver you know, there's parts of the show where you have to kind of do these crazy little weird things. And figuring those out, I always thought was a lot of fun, of how, to, how to figure those things out. I thought it was always fun, yeah. Great fun. They never put me in that kind of a dangerous situation, well, though. <laughs> I would have been like, no, I'm not going to do that. That's just stupid. Uh, I was so naive, dude. You were. You I almost died. Was, I was literally on the treadmill, on a moving treadmill on the back of a moving truck going, is this safe? And they're like, no. And I'm oh. like, okay. 
We actually, That's how we lasted we actually, we actually wrote to Warner Brothers and said, Tom's out. They used to make us drive to work ourselves, which when you're working 15 hours a day, especially Tom, our locations were like an hour away. So the whole cast got together and wrote a letter to the president of Warner Brothers and said, he, your lead character, our lead is going to die. <laughs> so they got him a car, remember? And then yeah. I got myself That's true. one, too. It makes good sense. I didn't know any better. Of course. But you, you work those kind of hours, you're exhausted. We, I, the longest hours we ever worked, we worked one day, was 22 hours. That's on set working. Well, as, as tired as we are as actors, you got an entire crew doing that, too. And yeah. if you got to drive home and try yeah. to function and then come back, you know, eight hours later, that's, it's, it's actually very dangerous. So yeah. it's smart that you guys did that. Yeah. Kudos on you. Yeah. Thank you, Mike. All right, thank you. Next question. Let's do it.